guys. Hey guys, what's good? Welcome back to the show. It's Beaker's Lab. The gang is back with Beaker and Lulu and Melly. Hey man, you guys know what it is because we're back here once again for season three of Day Slow Max. Hey guys, I want to welcome you back to a very special episode. Wow, that's great. That's great. <laughs> Guys, welcome back to 269 Days Till Max. We're, we're continuing what we did yesterday. We're trying to get ready for Talent 14. Clash has announced that it is real. I mean, we, we could have guessed that, right? But it is going to happen. Yesterday, we started talking about we got to farm like a billion Dark Elixir to finish our heroes because I'm going to upgrade as soon as it comes in, out into the game. But I got to have my heroes max. I got to have my walls max. And today is the second part of that because, look, we're doing good on the heroes. Not so much in the walls. So guys, get your shades on, get your shoes off, and can you imagine? I mean, we got one over the wall here, so we can kind of see it in action. Can you imagine how much that next level of wall is gonna be? I mean, can you imagine if they brought back the electric blue walls? Because days till max resumes in three, two, one. All right, guys, so we gotta be farming machines today, so we're gonna need you. Do we have a book? Yeah, we do. So why don't we start here? Do we have another book? Dude, I'm so glad we had two books. Okay, let's get this other one. Perfect, dude. Yo, they're looking good now. So guys, we're gonna go over this in a second, but have you noticed how, I mean, it's not truly like exponential increase, but every single wall gets so much more expensive. And I think we can tell you guys how much the next wall is gonna cost. And it is not gonna be pretty. Uh, we'll get to that in a second. But at the same time, guys, I'm gonna be psyched. Like even if it was 12 million gold each, yeah, I'll pay it. All right, guys, so before we figure out how much that final level wall is going to cost, we're going to hit a bulldog. Are you kidding? <laughs> I love this. I love this game. Dude, I was just thinking that, like, there is kind of kind of inflation in Clash because sometimes you will see, like, you get a new tunnel, everything gets more expensive, but you don't necessarily get more loot. So, the, like, the cost of living literally goes up. It's fine. It's, you know, I think that, I think that's part of their plan. They want to slow us down as we get to the higher town halls. And yes, Clash, uh, mission accomplished. It took us over 200 days to max, well, the last town hall. And, you know, clearly that was town hall 12, town hall 13 is even more. Can you imagine how long it's going to take to max town hall 14? Dude, I, I just wish I knew what direction they were going to go with this, right? Like, are we talking... Okay, look back at look back at Tunnel 13. What did they give us that was new? Not a lot of stuff. I mean, a new hero and uh, scatter shots, right? Yeah, I mean, great things, but it wasn't like they... Oh, I waited too long, dude. I'm so... Oh, no! That's fine, dude. It's fine. I'm just going to let her go. You know, I really wish those queens would fight, though. Can you girls fight? No? Okay, cool. Boom. So, you know, I was thinking about this the other day. I am kind of surprised about how awesome Town Hall 13, you know, the release of it was, considering, I mean, what did we really get? You know what I think it was? I think it was those max walls. I think they were just, I mean, in my case anyway, they got me so psyched for Town Hall 13. And, you know, maybe it was more than that. Maybe it was the Scattershot, the new hero. Uh, but really, man, I hope they can pull it off again. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> All right, man, we're getting in the middle here. This is fun. This is really fun. You know, I would rather be hitting a slightly higher level base. Uh, the defenses aren't bad on this base, but like the walls are. I guess it doesn't matter though. We had hogs anyway, but um, yeah, it's super fun when you get a base like this and you know, you don't want to feel like a bully, but at the same time, when you're just cruising through the middle, pretty good dude all right guys so you know what we need a bigger whiteboard i was looking on amazon and i found a couple crazy things so i i found a whiteboard it would be the entire back wall here and um i think i'm gonna get it essentially what i want to know is i mean what should we what should we be writing on it but we'll get to that in a second but guys also i think we should put up right there i just want to show you guys the difference between like level 10 11 12 13 and 14 walls because it gets crazy. I mean, you guys know you've, you've upgraded your town hall before. When you get to the new town hall, walls are too expensive. It's just like, 
Probably more people have quit Clash over that than anything else. I'm just guessing, but hang on. Hey guys, I was just checking on the bunnies. You guys good? Lulu looks like, uh, you look like a cowboy. Cool. Anyway, guys, so I was just looking at this, and it's kind of funny how they did this. It's like, they, okay, they're like 3 million. Okay, next one, 5 million. And then they get to the next one and they do 6 million. I think they just felt bad for us. I, I think they were gonna make it seven. But anyway, guys, the last one was 6 million. Where does that leave us for the next one? So here's what I think. Guys, if you look at these walls here, every single one gives you the same thing. I'm talking about high level walls. You get 1,500 more hit points. Look at this. Every single one, plus 15, plus 15, plus 15. It almost gives you diminishing returns as you go up because percentage wise, you know, by, by the time you get to the last one, you're getting like 10, 15% increase, which is good. I'm not saying it's not good, but you know, and because of that guys, I think they're gonna step it up next time. I think they're gonna give us 2000 or more hit points increase and therefore they're gonna have to make it more expensive. 8 million? I think that might actually be low, but yeah, I mean, it could be 8 million. It could be not. I'm talking, like, if it was 10 million, dude, I'd still get it. <laughs> you know, I'd still get it. But guys, that, that also opens up another fun question. Right now, one of my favorite things about Town Hall 13, and I know this is stupid, but the fact that the storages hold 18 million, it's just, you know, the Dark Elixir as well, like, you get, you get, you get a really good storage at this level, and I am interested to see how far they go up with that, because, dude, it's gonna be in the 20s, it's probably gonna be... Let's just go all the way up to 30. <laughs> 30 million. All right, guys, shades on, one more round, and then we're coming back. We're gonna do some of these walls, <laughs> which are currently the most expensive walls in the history of Clash, and yet we're talking about the next ones like, they're gonna be double. I can't wait, dude. Let's go. You guys, we said this in the beginning, but I really do think they could bring back are you kidding? What are you doing? Godfather, what's what's up? What's up, buddy? So guys, in the beginning, we mentioned that they could bring back, or at least a similar level of that electric blue wall that they took away. It was like, man, it was like five years ago. It was like six years ago. I had those walls and I loved them so much. Man, if they brought back something like that, I'd be so psyched. And it would have to be different. I mean, those, those are so old school looking now. They would have to make them a little beefier look looking, but dude, they could do it. I hope they do something like that. But at the same time, guys, we keep talking about how it would be cool if there was a completely different theme for the next town hall. So a lot of you guys have said like, what if it was a jungle theme? What if it was an, uh, I mean, I keep saying, what if it's an ice theme? The past town halls haven't really had a theme, although, you know, the buildings often look similar. That's about as much of a theme as you're gonna get. Like town hall nine had that very dark castle theme. I love that dude. And I think they could go back for that again if they didn't do like a electric blue theme or like an ice theme because Town Hall 13 is kind of an electric blue theme. I guess you could say it looks like ice too. I don't know. I love that color. So I'm always going to want it again, but it's cool. Oh no, we got an issue over here, guys. We got an issue. Can we take that out? Oh, come on. Get Get that air defense, get that air defense. It's too late, it's too late. Now, all we can hope, guys, is that we get a little bit further. Ah, uh, Queen's going down, I'm sorry, Queen. I'm sorry, I let you down, I let you down. Here we go. So guys, it's been kind of fun, but I've been I've been dropping a couple of giants in with the, with the crew here. She's still alive? This changes everything. I, I cannot believe she's still alive. What? All right, here we go. Wait, but how did she survive? She's still alive? I don't get it. I don't get it. Uh, okay. Well, I need some spells over here, dude. I wasn't even paying attention. Uh, can you stop killing me? That'd be great. Thanks. Okay, thanks. Okay, now let's get up here, guys. Oh, she finally died. She finally died. RIP. RIP to the most beastly queen ever. You know, we should have given her a rage spell because I think she could have lived the, the entire raid. Yeah, whatever. Guys, we haven't seen him much lately. Super whiz. Where you guys been? You know, I just noticed their hoods are too pointy. <laughs> right? Yeah. Yeah. 
Yep. Yep. Bird. What are you chewing on, buddy? Hey, hey, hey. You know what, man? It'd be kind of cool if you could debuff the hero by taking out their altar. You know what I mean? Like, it's kind of strange right there that we were looking at a hero where her altar, where she sleeps, and I guess they don't sleep anymore, really, unless they're they're knocked out. It'd be cool if you took that out. It actually gave them a debuff. And I don't mean it, like, kills them instantly or anything, but, you know, it, it like, stuns them for a second. That'd be kind of sick. So, guys, let's go back to base. We got to do these walls today, and there's so many things I want to talk about that we just can't get into it all at once. It's, it's too overwhelming. But really, guys, I want you to start thinking about, guys, what is going to be the new weapon inside of the next town hall? Right now, we got the Inferno. You can see right here, the Giga Inferno. It's pretty cool, too. But guys, before that, and honestly, I think it had more style, was the Tesla, the, the Giga Tesla. Honestly, it looked so good. It, it, was, it really started it all. So guys, how do you top either of those? I don't think you just jam a scatter shot on top. I don't think you just like jam an eagle artillery on top. It's not gonna be those things. And if it is, I'll dye my hair blue. Um, <laughs> remind me in one year that if Town Hall 14 has a scatter shot or an eagle on top, I have to dye my hair blue. Done. Guys, let's try to do four walls today. Now, first up, let me get this gold. Go, I love expensive walls. I don't know why. Guys, that is 12 million gold worth of walls. We get a discount because we have the gold pass. It's, it's so fun, and I don't know why. It's like hours and hours and hours of work. In three, two, one. Anyway, guys, let's go back over here. Now, can we do the, how do I not have enough wall rings? I mean, I always, I always have some. Hmm. Hang on. Come on, man. What do we got? What do we got? Give me something. Wall rings. All right, guys, let's do the other side with 12 wall rings in three, two, one. That looks bizarre, what? It's like a wall is standing on top of itself. Guys, you know what I really love about walls? It feels like we just did nothing. But we just did 24 million gold worth of walls. Anyway, guys, that is going to be it for today. I got to go. It's going to be a little bit shorter today. Well, I mean, the video might not be shorter, but I'm leaving before normal. So I think the video will go up earlier. I guess that's the good news. But guys, thank you for coming out today. If you enjoyed this one, let us know in the comments below. Be sure to leave too for Lulu. Hey, let's get Code Beak in there. I don't know if I have it in there. I seem to forget lately. Okay. Beak. So guys, this video and any other stupid video we do where we're trying to talk about like what we want for the next town hall or getting ready for the next town hall, it's going to be part of this playlist that we're doing. Countdown to town hall 14. By the time town hall 14 gets here, I want that playlist to be just like filled with stupid videos where we can actually go back and make fun of ourselves for the stuff that we got wrong. Because guys, I love that stuff. It is so funny to go back like three years and look at our old videos and all the stupid stuff we used to do. And this is, an, this is a great time because you know how, you know how clashers are. We come up with the craziest ideas that are almost never right. I guess every once in a while we do. We'll see you guys then. Peace.